Hey guys, I'm going to talk about the promos and how that you can go from zero to hero very, very fast. And it comes down to the promos that I, I picked a very good time to do FNM hero or MTG. No, that's my channel. FNM lion where the, I, you know, the point of the project is to go from no collection or the starter packs that you get, that the store is supposed to give you for free to a decent collection. It's not going to be like an epic collection, but it will be pretty decent. And I took off a little bit this week from make, uh, improving a deck. I will show you the one improvement I made on the deck, but to trade. And I traded like crazy because I tried to disconnect the two, you know, deck building and trading, but they are exactly identical. But the way that the FNM line has been working, and it's been working extremely well, is via promos. So if you enter FNM and you have a very easy FNM, like my FNMs, and a very easy, so Languish right now is an $18 promo. It used to be $18. I was able to trade it as $18. So paying $5 for $18 in trade is a very good deal. And that's assuming I finished very poorly. But trading $5 for a guaranteed $10 in trade, also a relatively good deal, uh, especially if you can also get store credit from it. And yeah, so Path to Exile and the new one, Serum Visions, which I have accumulated zero of so far, is a promo which justifies playing at FNM. And that's what I'm gonna talk about today. The next promo is like some type of like 04 wall or something. I don't know, it's not that great. But Path to Exile, Serum, Serum Visions, those two promos are worth playing for it and that's a very easy way for you to trade as well because these promos are readily available. So it's not only that they are valuable, it's just that fact that a lot of people who normally don't care about modern, and in my place, no one cares about modern, no one plays it, they just play standard. Look at these promos, they understand what it means, and they will trade them straight up for standard cards. And that's one of the best parts about uh, doing FNM at this time. If you do it for this month, you obviously Path to Exile is not the promo, you get another promo that is quite valuable. And it's easy to trade for these promos. Like It is extremely easy to trade for them, it's extremely easy to win them, and if you're doing a project or you don't have that good of a collection, let's say you win one, you get some store credit, you trade your store credit to a friend for another one, and then you trade like some, you know, kind of okay cards for two more and then you got a playset. With well, that playset, you can trade easily into like Fetchlands or Shocklands or Mutavolt or Whatever you want, you can trade the playset into because it's a gorgeous playset. And I know plenty of people who are more than happy to trade a $40 or $50 card for a playset of these ones because they want a playset. They don't want one or two. They want a bunch. They want a playset of them. So back to uh, my point and the point of this entire video is right now is a very good time to play FNM because the value is there. As long as you top eight, you're making what? Triple your, and then Languish was so easy. Like every single uh, event I went to had less than eight people. So it's a guaranteed Languish and then you play out for packs and things of that nature. And I'll show you what cards I was able to trade for at FNM Hero. But these FNM promos, tremendous amount of value for this month, tremendous amount of value last month, tremendous amount of value at most game days. Uh, this is how you build a collection. This is how you do it. Um, if I had, didn't have any other cards, that's what I would do is I would go to as many FNMs this month and last month and game days as I could. I would go to, if you have FNM Fridays and then you have one on Saturday, I would go to both because the value is there. So not only do you get the promo, but you also get the store credit. My store does a pretty crazy thing with store credit and um, I'll kind of explain that a little later. They always do, they add all the money up and then they multiply it by 1.5. So let's say 10 people enter and they all get 
the prize support is $75 store credit. And store credit is actually quite valuable because your singles are going to cost TCG lows or TCG mids. And it is very easy to stack your credit together to buy like a box or something. And the boxes are relatively cheap as well. So anyway, uh, pack, sorry, Path to Exile. Fantastic promo. Love it as a playset. People love it. And, you know, you look at it and it looks like it's Jace, right? I mean, has anyone like figured out who the artwork was? I feel like it's Jace. Uh, it's a beautiful card, by the way. Um, yeah, it's a beautiful Path to Exile. I can see this being as valuable as the other Path to Exile promo right now. Eventually, it I mean, it's gorgeous. I can't say anything about this card. Serum Vision, that's another like, that's uh, something else. <laughs> art-wise, but Path of Exile, I have no problem picking them up and keeping them long-term. Bye, guys.